you guys welcome back to my channel and thank you for clicking on this video without further ado I want to share the package I got today we're gonna do a unboxing of my first Hobonichi cover for my a6 so I ordered this probably about four days ago five days ago and to be honest I felt like it took a little bit longer than I had expected but it literally came within four days so I'm really really happy so I ended up picking up the Hobonichi Cho 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 I think that's how you say it Cho 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 I think <laughs> but it's the Mina Perhonen 2024 Hobonichi Cho cover and I got it from Amazon it is a navy blue suede fabric it kind of to be honest this reminded me of a couch like literally but it is so squishy and smooth oh my god I love it and I love the butterflies and everything the little tag here is undyed leather with the little bow how adorable is that? And a bow. Zip it open. Oh yeah. So it is a YKK zipper, which if you weren't familiar, they are a, a nominated zipper it? company. Oh. And we yep. open it up. It has gray inside. <laughs> and has gray inside it comes with two bookmarks a white and a green the ends have gray leather one is rectangle one is a little triangle and they match the same leather as these pockets I notice it has mesh here you can also open it from this side which is cool it has a pocket right here the pen loop this also opens for you to put your book if you like to have it in both slits and then it has another full length over here a full back pocket and for the most part I mean it's not completely laying flat but I hear that over time they do lay flat so that's good I'm definitely going to try to train it and I'm not sure if I'm gonna use the bookmarks I might because I actually enjoy using the bookmark in my passport cover and it does come with two little cards that I'm going to journal about so what is Mina Perhonen and it explains who she is a designer and then a little Hobonichi informational booklet mm. so let's put my planner in so this is my a6 2024 Hobonichi mm. that I did date for November 2023 mm. I added in these two sticky notes in the back so I'm going to have that like mm. that I'm not going to Put the front cover mm -hmm. in because I do like to see the front cover. Okay. So I'm gonna have the first I one in my sign. monthly, and then the second one I will probably put in the back, maybe like in my note pages, mm -hmm. just so I know where they start. So my concern with these little oh, bookmarks is when I want to close it. So I want to see, oh, okay. So that's good. When you go to zip it up, it automatically tucks them inside. Oh my God, you guys, I love this. It's not even that heavy. It's a little bit bulky, but 
for the most part it's not that much like big if you know what I mean it will I feel like not hold too much chunk if I add a bunch of stuff here in the pockets so so I have this little running balance card that I'm going to just tuck here in the back. I have these little memo cards that I made. If you guys are interested, I do have these in my bio. So I'm going to tuck them in there. Oh, I like that the pockets are sewed at the level that they stop so the stuff doesn't go all the way through for example this one stops right here this one stopped right where these stopped and then this one is also short this is the one that goes all the way into the bottom and then these are just little ones i love that i don't have my pen on me let me go bring it i will be using my mark on sarasa mark on point four in this sarasa pen body and I'm probably just gonna clip it in let me see how it works maybe it'd be best if I actually use the pen loop but I'm always afraid that it hits let me see oh no it actually doesn't really hit the book as much as I expected you see the pen loop it's a very big pen loop so it'll probably fit my Oh, it fits fountain pens really well. This actually looks super cute, even though this zipper... So, it is like a brass metal, but it's kind of like a gold. It's not a pure gold as this bow, but it's like a... It actually works really well. It's like a gunmetal kind of gold. I don't know how to explain it, but... It worked. It, this looks gorgeous. So now I'm reconsidering using fountain pens here. But I wanted to flip to my daily page to see how it laid flat. So I will have to train it a little bit. But as you can see, it lays flat. So I wanted to open it to where I'll be starting, which I did write stuff in here. So I can't be flipping to my first daily. But I, it lays flat pretty much flat and even if I'm writing on here what I was nervous on was that the zipper was going to affect or hit my wrist or something but to be honest it doesn't um, I'm really really happy with this cover I love it and I love that the gold matches the zipper that's what I was kind of nervous on I love that this is undyed and you get to see it patina with you and i think that's it you guys if you have any questions feel free to leave them in the box below and i will get back to you guys thanks for watching and i'll catch you guys in the next one bye bye